Connie Kaminsky, you're under arrest. Show me your hands. Show. 특수 범죄에 연루된 평범한 주부. I should probably start from the beginning. I'm a three-time gold medal winning Olympic race walker. 삼관왕 금메달리스트임에도 비인기 종목인 탓에 현실의 삶은 화려함과는 거리가 멀죠. 매일 아침 반가운 신문을 누구보다 기다립니다. 심지어 여러 개를 구독 중인데요. 그녀의 목적은 바로 쿠폰. 할인 정보에 따라서 대량 구매를 하며 대박을 노립니다. 1달러 할인 쿠폰 뭉치를 당당히 내미는데요. 어디 얼마까지 아끼는지 한번 보시죠. 와 대박. 집안은 거의 작은 마트가 되어 버렸습니다. What's this? It's like 50 jugs of Tide. Okay, that's $400 worth of detergent that I got for $57. 참고로 미국의 쿠폰 문화는 우리나라와 좀 달라서 제한 없이 중복 할인이 되는 경우도 많다고 하는데요. 리얼리티 TV 프로그램인 익스트림 쿠폰잉을 검색해 보시면 정말 놀라운 장면이 많이 나옵니다. 그녀가 이토록 쿠폰에 집착하게 된 이유는 아이를 갖기 위해 시험관 시술을 시도하느라 빚을 엄청나게 진 데다 어렵게 가진 딸아이를 결국엔 유산하게 되어 빈 아기 방을 물건으로 가득 채우며 공허함을 달래고 있었던 겁니다. Get a job. 남편은 의도적으로 출장을 늘려버렸고 그녀의 마음을 달래주는 건 이웃집에 사는 절친 조조 조조는 유튜버 꿈나무이자 자신이 만든 화장품 브랜드의 영업도 하고 있는데요 My credit's trash. I need to think about it. 상황이 좋진 않습니다. <웃음> Buy one, get one. Bogo. <웃음> oh, looky, I only need one more Colgate proof of purchase to get a free AT&T gift card. 그렇게 쿠폰에 미쳐 쓰레기통까지 뒤져대던 어느 날. Dear General Mills, I recently purchased a box of Wheaties cereal from my local A&G Family Mart here in Phoenix. When I opened it, I discovered, to my chagrin, that the cereal was stale. As a former Olympic athlete, I was very disappointed. Breakfast of champions? With cereal this stale, it's more like breakfast of champions. 야무진 항의 메일을 보낸 결과 원 플러스 원이 최고인 줄 알았던 그녀의 눈앞에 시리얼 한 박스 무료 쿠폰이 도착합니다. See that, Greg? Watch the pennies and the dollars will take care of themselves. They always send you coupons for free shit when you bitch to the manufacturer. 그렇게 꿀팁을 얻게 된 코니는 웬만한 회사엔 죄다 항의 메일을 보내는데요. Your cookie isn't soft and it sure as heck ain't chewy. Your rising crust pizza falls flat. If you meant for the cheese flavor to taste like feet, then bravo, my friend. You nailed it. Okay, open. 그 결과. <웃음> Connie. 그러다 문득 떠오른 생각. Actually, how much would you pay me for this Cottonelle coupon? Imagine if we got more of these and we sold them to people for half. That would that be a real business. How would you ever get enough to sell? 검색으로 쿠폰 제조 업체를 찾아냅니다. They'll be sent back to our advanced solutions printing facility and coupon clearing house in Chihuahua, Mexico. That's where all the coupons are. So what? You want to rob the place? Not rob, just remove or just separate. Are you crazy, Jojo? It's not fair. Like all you wanted was a successful business, but because someone ruined your credit, you can never fix that. And all I wanted was a baby, and I, now I gotta pay for that the rest of my life. No. 나름의 논리로 합리화를 마치고 국경을 넘어 찾아온 이곳 한 남자가 눈에 들어옵니다. 금연 구역에서 흡연이라. We need that guy, cause he's already bending the rules. We got two for the price of one. Bogo. 
하지만 여긴 워낙 치안이 안 좋은 곳이라 경계심이 상당하죠. 그렇게 부부도 한 배에 타기로 합니다. With each coupon we print, there is always extra, even with the free coupons. It is normal for us to destroy these extra coupons, but no more. And as for the border, this is no problem. Who cares about coupons? 훔치는 게 아니라 처리하는 것일 뿐. 그렇게 코니의 공짜 쿠폰 판매 사업이 시작되는데. SavvySuperSaver.com. 조조가 유튜브로 홍보를 담당하고. 간단하게 홈페이지를 만들어 판매를 개시하자 주문은 그야말로 폭주합니다. 생전 처음 만져보는 액수의 현금 뭉치는 생필품 창고에 자국자국 숨겨둡니다. My hands hurt. Don't you feel like this is all happening way too fast? Fast is good. Fast is what? Frozen? No, no. 한꺼번에 너무 많은 금액이 몰려서 의심을 사게 된 것인데요. Oh, so really? Girl, My specialty is cybersecurity. You guys have any idea what that means? No, no. not a clue. I can unfreeze this for you, but we gotta spread this shit out. What you guys need is a front for your business. All of this money is dirty, so don't go spending dough on shit you can't write off. Give it six months and make sure it ain't alarmageddon out there. From now on, use this. It's an iron key. It's military grade encryption. Just stick it in your USB. I take 10% of everything you make. Don't be doing this shit at home. Rent a stash house, okay? I don't know what half those things you said were. And do you have like a pad and pad, a pen and paper? Yeah. yeah. Or give me my phone back. I'll take notes. Just to write it down. 전문적인 내용은 하나도 이해를 못했지만 어쨌든 해커가 만들어준 가짜 신분들로 새 계좌를 트고 다시 영업을 개시한 그녀들. 대량으로 유통되는 쿠폰 때문에 마트들의 피해 사례가 속출하고. What's with all the free fucking coupons? s e v e n t y f o new voice messages. One counterfeit coupon has cost us hundreds of thousands of dollars. Here's the f u e l e o n The rules are rules. Well, we're happy to sell it to you at full price. You should put that in the burn pile. 몇날 며칠 잠도 안 자고 영수증들을 모두 확인하며 불법 쿠폰을 사용한 흔적을 찾습니다. Yes. I was able to trace the credit card number back to you back here. You purchase these coupons off a website. Watch the pennies and the dollars will take care of themselves. 홈페이지까지 알아낸 캐는 FBI에 신고를 하는데요. China. Oh, can't be China. China couldn't pull this one off. Now these. This is a crisis at a national level. Okay. This is my Pelican brief. Okay. You are going to be hearing from DC real soon. Yeah. Okay. Thanks so much, guys. Thank This you. is fun. Who the fuck let that kook in? I mean, come on. Coupons. Coupon. Why don't we let that ship get lost in DC? Ken의 보고서는 최하위 말단 직원의 책상으로 가게 됩니다. Thank you. Mm-hmm. 해커의 조언대로 10원 한장안 쓰고 모아둔 지 벌써 
somebody, Tina, say that all the money is dirty? Did she? Call her ass off. 하지만 천재 에커는 쉽게 연락이 닿지 않는 법. Jojo, we need to get all of our money out of these different bank accounts, buy a bunch of expensive stuff, and then sell it. 어디선가 대충 주소들은 대로 돈 세탁을 해보려 합니다. How are we gonna clean it all? You know we gotta go shopping. This beauty is priced at two hundred and sixty-five thousand dollars. We'll take them all. Don't forget the boat. Oh yeah, how much for the boat? F A B U L O U S every day like. I made an appointment at the fertility clinic. What did Rick say? I didn't tell Rick. This is your last shot. We still have some of Rick's sperm from the last time, so. Do we have to use his sperm? Yeah, I think we'd like to shop around. Six foot two, high IQ, extremely high Ooh. motility levels. His little guys are like Olympic swimmers. Do you take cash? Where the fuck is all your money? We're cleaning it. You don't have any dirty money. Wait, that we don't. All the fucking money is already clean. Oh. Cause your front company, Back to Black's sole purpose is to clean your money. I really wish you would have let me write. That's what down. I'm saying. You didn't let her write it down, so we didn't know. Oh, yeah. But. We bought a few things. This is not a few things. This is a big red flag. You need to sell this shit now. We're gonna figure that out. Uh, hello? Ken, hi, my name is Albert Anderson. I'm calling from the Federal Bureau of Investigations about your counterfeit coupon case. I've been calling you guys, leaving messages, and here you are finally getting back to me. This is real soon. Do you realize that these counterfeit coupons have been mailed out all over the country? Like. Postal, snail mail, not by email. Like through the post office. Okay, help is on the way. Simon Kilmer, a U.S. postal oh, inspector. Federal... They said that they were sending the FBI. So what do you do? You like carry mail around or something? FBI가 아닌 우편국 조사관의 등장에 적잖이 실망한 켄. 여기서 잠깐 토막 상식. 미국의 우편 검열국은 미국 우정공사의 법 집행기관으로. 우편 행정과 관련된 범죄 현장에서 활동하는 연방 경찰 기관입니다. I carry a firearm, I solve crimes, and I arrest people. The postal inspectors will take it from here. But this is my case. We could no. be partners on this. No, we can't be partners. Why don't you order some off the website? Then they'll come in the mail, and then we can all see where they're from. So, okay, so the zip code on the postmark and the zip code on the return address, well, they don't match. Anything starting with 85, that's Arizona. And the last three digits, 013, that's Phoenix. These things were mailed Mail from. from Phoenix. That's impressive. You gotta let me in on this thing. I'm Mr. Phoenix. I'm there every month. There's nine A and G stores in the area. I can help. All right. We're just looking for any customers with strange coupon habits. 그렇게 피닉스에 있는 모든 마트를 돌아다니며 탐문 수사를 시작하는데요. Oh wait. We do have one other cashier. She had this fucking catchphrase. Watch the pennies. Blah blah blah. Blah blah blah. And then the dollars will take care of themselves. Yeah, that's exactly it. Description, what does she look like? What's she? She's like three feet tall. That's the gal. That phrase, did you not hear? Watch the pennies, dollars take care of themselves. That's literally a plastered on the Savvy Super Saver website. We are investigating a counterfeit coupon ring that we believe is operating somewhere within your postal routes. Hey, Earl, what about that gal you won't stop blabbing about? You know, the, the girl. She makes all these coupon videos. What's her name? Uh, Coco? Jojo? It's Jojo, right? I don't know nothing about nobody. Yet. 평소 조조를 흠모하던 우체부 어른 경고의 메시지를 남기는데. Uh, that's how one idea for JoJo is real, real important, Miss Johnson. You just gotta promise that she get that letter, Miss Johnson. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. 사실 미행을 당하고 있었죠. And now he's just standing there. And Joanna Johnson, 33 years of age. Joanna Johnson. Oh, JoJo. Yeah, well, and another stack of them bills showing up here yesterday. Okay, I'm gonna take care of it later. Okay. Love you, Mom. Don't come in here late. 못한 조조는 Targets on the move. 아무것도 모른 채 출근을 하고 코니도 곧바로 출근을 하는데요. 잠복 근무를 하던 켄과 사이먼이 뒤따릅니다. Where the minivan come from? I'm gonna do a bank run. I'll be back in a jiff. 그렇게 드디어 코니를 찾아내게 됩니다. Connie Kaminsky. Now, cashier Greg Garcia corroborated. Ooh, that's her. And get this, 
former Olympian race walking. <laughs> you say race walking? That's a real thing? It's a largely ignored but often ridiculed event, kind of like couponing. It's an invoice, a lease on an airplane hangar. An airplane hangar? I think I owe you an apology. You guys are like the FBI. Negative. FBI's like us. Don't fuck with the post office. <laughs> Wanna do a ride along? So what are we dealing with? Coupons! It's two women counterfeiting coupons. Dear Jojo, you in some serious shit, girl. You need to shake your booty out of town because the feds are onto you. From your number one fan, hugs and kisses. Feds? <웃음> 결국 나란히 체포된 코니와 조조. 경납고에 있던 21대의 차량과 보트, 그리고 2,500달러 상당의 쿠폰을 모두 압수당하죠. Sir, what about this room full of food? What about it? It's food. Leave it. 뉴스를 통해 소식을 들은 어른 조조를 걱정합니다. I want you to go in there with me. What? Really? For starters, let's talk coupons. I mean, most people undervalue coupons. I don't undervalue coupons. I suppose that's why I'm here. People use coupons to save money, and I think you took advantage of that. That's not really why people use coupons. It's not about what you buy. It's about the uh, the feeling you get when folks use coupons. Their oxytocin levels they kind of spike, and they call it the coupon high. You had a good life, Connie. You had the nice house and loving husband. Why, why, why would you risk losing all of that? You happy with the life that you're living? Haven't you ever wanted just a little bit more out of life? And just because you want a little more out of life does not give you an excuse to break those laws. It is one year for every hundred thousand dollars of fraud. You are facing 40 years to life. What? 40 years to life? You want a Johnson? That's me, hi. You made bail, let's go. Earl? 우체부 어리 보석금을 내줬군요. Connie Kaminsky? That's me. You got a visitor. What the fuck, Connie? Would you just bail me out? Oh, you don't have a coupon for that? I'd like a divorce. My lawyer, this super expensive fella, sure had an interesting way of looking at things. These corporations you're accused of exploiting use loopholes all the time to take advantage of a broken system. My client is just following the lead of a successful corporation. The court sentences the defendant, Joanna Johnson, to 10 days in jail, suspended, and one year probation. As for the defendant, Connie Kaminsky, she will be incarcerated 11 months with the possibility of parole. 11 fucking months? She cost P&G alone $80 million. For P&G and for every other company, this was just a write-off. Bottom line, they just want this to go away. Well, that's all there is. That's law enforcement. You just do the best that you can, Ken. I enjoyed working alongside you. Don't go searching for too much. You're pretty great the way you are. 그가 가진 꿈이나 내면에 비해 작은 곳에 갇혀 꽉 막혀 있던 켄은 이 사건으로 좀더큰 사람이 되었고 기간이 지난 쿠폰도 너그럽게 넘어가 주며 우편 검열국에 지원도 합니다. Rick and I got a divorce. Please take it all. I just want to get rid of it. And after paying the fancy lawyer. We still have a little money left over. 감옥에 가지 않은 조조와 남친이 된 우체부는 몬테네그로에서 새로운 사업을 계획하죠. Oh, and did you know Montenegro has no extradition to the US? Sometimes you look back and you think if that didn't happen and that didn't happen and that didn't happen, I wouldn't be who I am today. It really doesn't matter how you get to the finish line. Just as long as you get there. 영화 쿠폰의 여왕이었습니다. 이 영화는 실화를 모티브로 하고 있는데요. 2012년 아리조나에서 3명의 주부가 수백만 달러에 달하는 쿠폰을 대량으로 위조하여 온라인으로 판매하다 체포된 사건으로 40여 개의 제조업체가 역대급 규모의 피해를 입었고 리더였던 로빈 라미레즈는 2년형을 받았다고 하네요.
이 영화에 숨겨진 또 하나의 주제는 바로 과소평가되는 것들이 지닌 힘인데요. 경보가 작은 걸음으로 엄청난 속도를 내듯이 코니는 쿠폰이라는 보잘것없는 존재로 4천만 달러라는 거금을 벌어들입니다. 이 사건을 해결한 건 역시 과소평가받는 직책의 사람들인데요. 마트 손실방지 전문가와 우편국 조사관 그리고 이 둘을 이어준 FBI 말단 직원이 그렇습니다. 이들은 남들이 주목하지 않는 작은 영수증 하나, 송장번호 하나 등 사소한 것들을 무시하지 않았고 결국 이 사건을 해결할 수 있었죠. 세상은 언제나 큰 것들에만 주목합니다. 하지만 세상 모든 것을 연결하고 무시하지 못할 중요한 역할을 하는 것은 결국 이 작은 것들이 아닐까요? 영상 보시는 동안 느끼는 작은 즐거움이 모여 큰 행복으로 이어지길 바라면서 전 다음에 또더 좋은 영상으로 찾아뵙겠습니다. 시모비였습니다